All right, you guys, welcome back to the channel. Hopefully, y'all are doing well. Today, we just received some breaking information in regards to Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. We have some new gameplay screenshots. Massive thanks to DBS Hype over on Twitter. I'll be sure to have them linked down below in the description. So, these screenshots are actually coming from the Psycho Jump magazine. I just appreciate how they're promoting the heck out of Sparking Zero. First, we got the teaser trailer, then we had to wait nine months for the official trailer. But now, even on the Dragon Ball Games official page, <laughs> they have it as their banner. We have the logo right there for their profile picture. And it seems like we've been getting information every single week, right? Look, we even have a brand new HD screenshot of Majin Buu. I haven't seen that one just yet. <laughs> but down here, y'all already know, we got the Goku ones. Uh, we got the different cast characters, Piccolo, Krillin, Yamcha, Tien. And as well as V-Jump scan itself. The promotion is going crazy. And I can definitely appreciate that. Stay tuned to the channel for everything Dragon Ball Sparking Zero related. And make sure to drop a like on the video. I'll greatly appreciate it. And let's hop straight into it. So right here we do have the full scan. I also went ahead and Google translated this. We'll get to that as soon as we break down every single image over here. So I think this one has all of the new ones. And this one right here. As every single screenshot that we've seen already. Uh, so, top left, we do have Saiyan Armor Trunks in his Super Saiyan form, utilizing, I think, the Heat Dome Attack. <laughs> oh, we already know that cinematic is going to go crazy. Funny enough, we do have Perfect Cell right beside Saiyan Armor Trunks. If only it was in Perfect Cell, that would be cool. Do we even have all of Cell's transformations in this game? We're not entirely sure about that. Of course, only a few certain characters are confirmed from the Z and Super Anime. We do have the Piccolo Special Beam Cannon image. We actually got this one, an HD version of it, a couple days ago. Same with the Goku one at the top right corner. So those two, nothing too new. But the ones down here, Yamcha doing his iconic pose. I'm pretty sure that's going to be the start of the Wolf Fang Fist Ultimate Attack. Or this could be a Super, not entirely sure. Hercule with the... Presence? Yeah, yeah, that's part of the ultimate as well. This is an awesome one. Bergamo? We have, I mean, I already know that Bergamo was confirmed, but man, I can't believe it. I'm looking forward to all the other Dragon Ball Super characters as well. Just imagine an HD Unreal 5 engine format. <laughs> Full power Broly. Ultimate Jiren. Topo Dispo. I have no idea what attack he's utilizing because he's not playable in any other Dragon Ball games. So this could be an... I'm pretty sure it is an ultimate attack. It seems like every single image we've been getting so far either has the character using an ultimate or transformation. So most likely this image of Bergamo is an ultimate attack as well. Wait, so does that mean that Gigantic Rage over here that Wrathful Broly is using right now, is that going to be an ultimate? Because normally that's a super attack. Interesting, interesting. I mean, we could have cinematic supers as well. But, oh, we have two more images down here. Krillin utilizing his ultimate attack we've been getting a bunch of different angle screenshots of this ultimate right here <laughs> i believe this is like the third one and android 18 that looks like the very end cinematic of her ultimate attack after she throws out the attack at the opponent behind her you know the destructo beam whatever it's called not entirely sure anyway as for this one we do have tn at the top left corner all right this is a lot clearer. Yo, that is epic. Obviously, that's the very start of Tien's tribe beam. I really want to know if he jumps up into the air first. But I really do like how vicious the tribe beam ultimate attack is. You, you see how he's struggling just to put his hands together, just to form the triangle. Why are all these squares creating triangles? Whatever the meme, however it went. <laughs> if you know, you know. But of course, if Tien keeps utilizing the tri beam attack as he did in the Z anime going up against semi perfect cell. He almost destroyed himself, right? He used up too much key. This ultimate attack is great and it should utilize stamina or maybe health, even. No, probably stamina if there's a stamina bar in this game. But there should be unique features added to the gameplay that will just make things a bit more interesting or more accurate to the anime, if you will. Comment down below what you guys think about that. They had a little bit of that in Xenoverse 2. And even in the classic Budokai Tegaichi series, I mentioned this in the last video, but Dragon Ball Z Broly has super armor for some of the weaker characters, right? 
if I'm remembering correctly. And that just makes the game, in my personal opinion. We do have Dragon Ball Super Trunks. Again, we've seen that image before. Same with Android 17 and Jiren. Oh, there it is once again. Heat Dome Attack from DBS Trunks. And this one right here, Perfect Cell. I know it was in the uh, other image as well, but I didn't really describe it. It seems like he's utilizing Perfect Barrier. Really want to know if any ultimate attacks can overpower the barrier attacks in the game. I highly doubt it, but it definitely seems like he's using that attack for sure. Uh, yep, we have the Goku and Piccolo ones. We have the logo right there. Let's go ahead and zoom out real quick. Let's see if we're missing anything. Again, we will go over the English translated version of this scan. Uh, Vegeta utilizing Gallic Gun. Let's see. Zero. Yo, I'm looking forward to this game. It's going to be extremely epic. There's the gameplay screenshot that we've seen many times before of Blue Goku going up against Vegeta. And here we have the enhanced Blue Goku screenshot. It's definitely a lot more developed. I even did this comparison with this screenshot compared to the original one we got from the teaser trailer. And yeah, all the new ones down here once again. Pretty awesome update so far, if you ask me. Let's go ahead and go over to the English scan. Alright, so what do we have here? Let's see. Many battles from Dragon Ball Super. Cool. I'm just looking forward to the official character roster. A large gathering of past Dragon Ball characters. More confirmation? More confirmation right there. I mean, it's already been confirmed, but hopefully this is also referring to GT and original Dragon Ball characters. Besides just Z characters. Strongest warrior. All right, cool. Stronger, even more flashy, and evolved special move. Oh, an evolved special move. I'm assuming they're referring to the cinematic version of Gallic Gun as we saw from the official trailer. I think that's... <laughs> they're calling it Evolved now, right? Just because in some... Xenoverse 2 had some cinematic super attacks like Super God Fist, but not every single one of them were cinematics. <gasps> oh, the game release dates? It's still undecided. I'm pretty sure they have the game up and ready. They're just promoting it and, you know, looking for a good time to release the game. <laughs> <laughs> That's just pure speculation. But of course, PlayStation 5, Xbox Series, next-gen console version only. And we have the, the publisher, Bandai Namco. And of course, it's the 3D action genre. New life masterpiece that Dragon Ball fans all over the world have witnessed. The latest work is finally on the move. Fly around with dance techniques. All right. Let's see. Masterpiece Dragon Ball action game born the sparking series the latest work is battle with a lot of super battles series You can fight in super flashy waiting again. This is Google translated So it's not going to be the most accurate, but we're just working with what we got That's the charm of the look at the screen the whole world is You should know what <laughs> The whole world you should know why you want all right Let's see, we have this description right here. Shaking the heavens and earth with a devilish expression on his face. Goku goes, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan. And what does that say? Yeah, I don't know what that one says. It's too blurry. This guy too? Characters that surprise even fans? Yep, Hercule. Yo, does this mean we're going to be getting characters like... Uh, wait, what are their names from Dragon Ball Super Broly? We got... Lemo, yeah, Lemo and Chilai. You know, not really characters who normally fight in a Dragon Ball. Very interesting to see later down the line what they come up with. Largest character M. I'm assuming the largest character roster. Uh, and then last but not least, we have this description right here. Yeah, this one is just way too blurry. Don't even know what that says. Uh, let's actually go back to this one. Decide the match at once with the strongest power released all right so we got that one and this is it for today's video man who's looking forward to this game it's going to be pretty dang epic whenever this does drop hopefully they stay behind this for years you know dropping dlcs something similar to xenoverse 2 how we're up to dlc 17 right now <laughs> i want this game to succeed for real anyway this is it for today's video. Thank you guys for the immense supports. Y'all already know, stay tuned for everything 
Dragon Ball Sparking Zero related. And once again, massive thanks to DBS Hype for sharing this over on Twitter. Brand new gameplay screenshots. Let me know what you guys think about them. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.